Hello, my name is Jocelyn Cole. Today I'll be conducting a virtual lab to standardize NOH, which is sodium hydroxide, with KHP, which is potassium hydrogen chelate solution. This is a acid-base titration. So we will now proceed. In this problem, you will accurately determine the concentration of a solution of sodium hydroxide and AOH using a 0.5 molar of potassium hydrogen tallate KHP standard solution. We can now proceed. We will now gather our materials, which is one molar of NAOH. OH, 0 0.5 molar of KHP, and the indicator, which is naltaline. And we will also need a 50 milliliters barrette. Having all our materials, we can now proceed to add the NAOH into the 50 milliliters barrette, we will add 52 milliliters so that it can reach zero. We will now proceed with the KHP solution. We'll add in one milliliter of the indicator, phenotaline, and now we can proceed the titration. We will pour until until we see a color change in the in the solution we have now we can notice that a slight decoloration in the solution has occurred so that means that titration has occurred so now we will proceed to record the volume which was 13.1. I will now proceed to perform the same experiment three times. Okay, so a slight decoloration has now occurred. So now we will record. So now we will proceed to do the other two. A slight decoloration has occurred again, so we can record this. To me, this is 13.1. So now another Slight decoloration has occurred. So to find the average volume, you will need to add all these three numbers and then divide it by three to give you 39.4 divided by three is equal to 13.13. .13. So this is the formula that I will be using this is the molarity of the KHP and the volume of the KHP, which is the acid, equals to B, which is the BS, the molarity of the BS, which is NaOH, and the volume. So this is the balanced chemical equation. So now to move on, we already know that the molarity of the acid, which is 0 0.500, and the volume is the volume was 0 0.025 liters, but we converted to milliliters, which gave us 25 milliliters. Is equal to the molarity of the BS, but the molarity is unknown. So this is what we will be finding. And we do know the volume, which is 13.13. .13. So now we can proceed to find the moles of the KHP solution. To find the moles of the KHP so solution, you will need to 
multiply the 0 0.500 by the 25 milliliters equals to 12.5. As we can see in the balanced chemical equation, one mole of KHP equals to one mole of NaOH. So therefore 12.5 is the mole of NaOH. So now we will proceed to find the molarity of the BS because that is unknown. So to find the molarity of the BS, we will need to divide the, the moles, the number of moles, which is 12.5 divided by the volume, which is 13.13, equals 0. 0.13. 952. To conclude, and according to my titration results and my calculations, I can safely say that 0 0.952 is the concentration of NaOH.